Ahead of Thursday's emergency EU summit in Brussels, these asylum seekers took to Sicily's streets. They want solutions to racism, bureaucracy, and joblessness. Bubakar, a Gambian who came to Italy on a packed migrant boat eight months ago, led the protest. We would like uh, other uh, uh, important uh, people to see uh, and feel for us and help us out from this uh, mess. Wanting to know more about the mess he referred to, we searched for Bubakar. We found him here at this publicly funded group home for migrant minors. 72 young people who came here without their parents. They sleep six to a room and share four toilets. What was supposed to be an emergency three-month housing solution on the road to asylum has become a stagnant waiting game. Bubakar left Gambia at age 11 looking for education opportunities and a better life. He made his way to Libya via Senegal, Burkina Faso, Mali, and Niger. He and the others here paid human traffickers hundreds of Libyan dinars to cross the Mediterranean crammed onto a packed boat for four days without water, food, or respite from the sun. Our brothers are uh, victims that are dying. They crossed the sea and came in here, and still we are still facing the same problems. Young adults still in their teens, they don't know if they'll ever see home again. I miss my father and my brothers and my sisters. I miss my family. Their futures are uncertain. They cling to the hope that one day they will receive asylum get educations, and secure jobs. Stephanie Fried, CCTV, Catania, Italy.